Oops. Let's see. Let's see. Apparently we're alive, but we're not alive. Who would have thought? Who would have fucking thought? But you know what I say. It is what it is. It's a world that we live in. It's not what even been is truly love. He through the heaven and struggle. And no one gonna tell us what to do as we move through this city. Fuck, I don't know, Jess. Oh, we got the guns and we got the bombs. I, I don't know how the song goes. I, everything I know about that song is that it's uh, from um, it's a perk song from uh, Call of Duty. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, let us let us continue off where we left off. The crew is bizarre. The Uber High Ride home feels especially comforting today. The Berlin chapter of the Humanist Poly Club has suffered a terrible blow. And you're the one who dealt it. Bart Star's plan to incite the wave of bloody violence across Berlin has been derailed. It isn't often that a shadow runner gets to prevent an atrocity on the job. But it is certainly a welcome one. Alright then, ladies and gentlemen. To catch up real quick on what we did last time. Instead of... It, Instead of following up on a lead we got from a dead body, no. Well, yeah. No. Oh. Just show you have no information to discuss about the estate. Please come as soon as you can. All right. All right. So here's the deal. We're gonna rush rush through this real quick since we did it last time. Yeah. Yeah. Here's here's the pay data. Yeah, uh, we killed the leader of that humanist chapter. He is now dead. He had 10 HP, which of course is just, you know, uh, a social commentary on that racism makes you weaker because he wasn't even a mage and he was weaker than the starting elf mage. Yeah, we delivered the data we also got. Mm, yeah, some big names here. Give us more money. Okay, uh, Simi, Simi, draw Simi. Now we did, we did, talk to this girl last time. So I would, just, I would just try to use the same things that I do did last time. Lovely singing, blah 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 blah. And then I never tried to get you off the stims. Maybe someday you won't need them. How do you like it here? That's good. Of course you can stay. Alright, we talk to Simi. Ah, Dein Vankela. Lucky strike. Did we talk to her? We're sure that... Yeah. Not changed. Is the bartender here any good? So you wine drinker? Hmm. Let's see, let's see. I can't remember. Oh well to each their own. I've uh, been finding the work. You have people too. Point. Uh, we did this last time. Um, it's nice, nice one, but I know if that's no, I would compared to most Berlin. The truth besides about the strength this gets. Now it's virgin and bucolic with all of the the fuck yet this bu bucolic name. Bucolic uh, relating to the pleasure aspect of the countryside and country life. Well, there you go, boys. You just learned the new one. What? Damn. Damn, I'm slurring everything today. Holy shit, I haven't spoken this much in years. And since the last time I played Leighton Company with the boys. 
but even then I spelled mostly native. You find yourself a lovely picturesque little corner of Berlin, to shame. Yes, I have to give your old boss some credit for them. See you around. See you. See you. Alright. Oh, fuck. Don't tell me we're gonna have to do like everything that we did last time. Uh, Zach Flint. Ah, oh, fuck. We're gonna go for everything, right? Alright, cool. Uh, let's see. And that's the dark. Ah, oh, fuck. Did I buy shit again? I have cash, need weapons. Let's go. Alright, let's see. Outfit. Uh, we went with strength and HP, and for weapons, we picked up ourselves a nice. A nice. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Pure steel. Uh, there it is. Oh, yeah, that's a shotgun. Alright, time to sell. Alright, time to sell. Uh, let's see. Equipment. Alright, we're selling the AK. We're selling the Mossberg, the Predator, the Blues, the Hyper, the Jazz, the Advanced Method, the Two Nitros. And the basic match. Uh, 500. Alright, got me so. Let's see. Ah, I fucked the gem. Yeah, don't have to do it at home base. Let's start the lane. Probably. Just checking in. Mark was important in this points. We're all stepping up. Alright, this is the one that we didn't do. I want to hear more about the war. Then rumbles and massages, phantom pain is internet. Damn it. Why won't the war just let an old soldier fade away? Let you uh, match out to promised. The Euro Wars. <laughs> Your military. Where, where did you serve? Back home with the Finnish Defense Brigade. Jager Brigade. Aaron <laughs> It's all it always comes back. Length 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 of fist. Either out of repressed anger or more phantom pain. His little face betrays nothing. The Russians start to come at this from the north as well as the west, though through the Lapland, thinking it's weak to them. It thought wrong, the snow was painted pink on both sides of the border. And more about the Euro Wars. Now there's much I can tell you that wouldn't have, that you wouldn't have learned in school. That you should have learned in so <laughs> Russians invaded hell if I can remember why. What was more mess back then than it is today, if you ask me. They attacked Poland and Finland first. Poland broke for within months, opening the door into Germany. And no contact in Berlin, but mind you, can't really say how bad things really were. I had battles of my own to worry about. Sorry, they want to bother you about it. Alright, so that's that. The drone is sold. Alright, so we do safe house. I'm pretty sure I have to talk to anyone here. Yeah, because we watched the DVDs of uh, Alan last time. So, let me just equip. Uh, confirm. All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen. Now we're gonna go outside. Let me just take a real quick look at what is going on on the Squid Seven. All right, we do this mission. Then I assume we can talk to people. Then. All right, so we can do shit with her, cause you know, it's a corporate drone. An old model of a corporate drone that was stolen, of course. Hey, Legend, you have been busy. Jasip travels fast, don't it? It's not Jasip, it's worse. Survivor, really. Aren't there child labor laws on here? 
admits that you need to survive working like this. This seems more like a joke, but... Hmm, that's a good question. A mage that you need to survive working like this. Well, I know. Out it says, if you do not spy, how will you know who's boss? Or something like that. I'm just kidding. What do I know? I think that was important, but don't you think that should be a lesson for when you order, don't you think? Oh, yeah, this this is the... Terry puffs up indignantly, and you realize how young she really must be. Child. She shouldn't be out of our teens yet. And what does that mean? If you get her in until you need some street smarts, you're still wet behind the ears. You're surprised what I know. But you don't seem like the perceptive type. So that's... But that's to be expected. She practically hisses her response. Her eyes suddenly narrowed and venomous. She looks down at herself. Then the clowns leave her bright face. Listen. I have better things to do right now than getting tickled. Ticked. We'll try later, okay? Yep. See you around. Uh, we did this encounter last time. Yes. Yeah. Alright, we shouldn't die. Alright. Goodbye, orc. Damn, she don't even know my name. Ah, oh, I'm heartbroken. Anyways, let's go into the sewers. You guys like the sewers? I remember the sewers. The dude place, baby. Hey, buddy. Sorry about it, but you use some help for you? You want to make a little extra scratch? Shouldn't be long. Sure, what's the problem? Well, me and my buddy Victor got called in from the next year is over. Something wrong with the sewers around here. The lot of plumbers and mechanics are all useless. Which and I talked to them, tried to get them to give us the maintenance schedule for your sewer pumps. They just scratched their heads at us. So that the machinery down there just took care of itself. My best guess is that your pumps have shut down. Happens from time to time without proper maintenance. When the pumps shut down, the waste starts piling up and it's causing some pretty major off-flow problems downstream. Mm, go on, I'm listening. Well, Victor went down into the sewers while I was getting stuff out of the truck. When I came back, well, I was about to climb down there when I heard these off screams. They went on and on, and then they just stopped. I froze up, nearly shit myself, to be honest. I know what to do, man. But I can't go down there, not after them. Problem is probably something basic. A claw that needs to be cleared, something like that. Just throw a grenade in it. Restarting the pump should take care of it. But no goddamn way am I going down there. If you do the job for me, I'll give you the name when we're paid for it. I don't need it. You can have all of it. I can live without the money, but someone else to pitch those pumps before I can leave. Eh, fine. You're a lifesaver, Chema. You found Victor? Well, if you're still alive down there, tell him I'm sorry. Alright. Alright. Time to, time to level up. Ah, look at this. Look at this. You know, with that, with that strike, with that, with that range combat. With this. What did I upgrade last time? I could, like, put one more in bio that just, you know. Oh, oh, you hit up. Oh, oh gee, much better, much better. Alright, let's see, let's see, what do I need, what do I need? Uh, don't need intelligence. Yeah, I don't need intelligence, I'm a good kid. I think I leveled the throwing. A little. Man, this is gonna be useful if we ever, you know, decide to sink money into grenades. But I want that eye, since it's a useful skill and then headshot. I grab these, I'm fucking set and with five. Mm, if we grab that, we should be good. A strength of 6, which is awesome. We got bonus HP. 
with that witness rifle. Mm, Dodge should use a little leveling, but what do I know? We'll see about it. Alright, assemble the team, let's head on in. Alright, so we're gonna need a couple of boys. I always. Let's try up Dietrich. Oh no, McConnell, Mixie, Pummel, and Lucky Strike. And yeah, we'll grab either. We're going into the sewers, might as well bring the vanilla. And always want a Decker. I always want a Shaman and a Decker. Because I'm not either of those. And the third spot is usually the drone person. But we don't have a drone. So yeah, we're entering the sewers. What can I say? Sometimes gotta do a little backyard cleaning. Ah, the sewers. A ghostly labyrinth of tunnels and dead-end passageways that make up the network of sewers beneath the clusbus. We climb down the ladder into the shallow underworld and reward the wave of foul smells that washes over you, clogging your sinuses and saturating your clothing. As your light adjusts to the light, as your eyes adjust to the light, you find yourself standing on the edge of a narrow channel of murky gray water. Gray green water. In the rush of channel water that draws down the tunnel. You catch a flash of motion in your peripheral vision. Something man size moving fast, fully not close to the far end of the tunnel. You strain your eyes to see it, but no whale, the thing, whatever it is, is gone. We don't need to burn our clothes after this. And that is probably a mutant. So now a damage. Large fry, I'm bringing my basic drenic. <laughs> hmm, Archie. Well, this is gonna be interesting. Let's see, piles of bones, pump one, pump two. Hmm. Hmm. Very interesting. Very interesting. Let's first inspect what this is. These metahuman bones have been picked clean. Hmm. The rats. We the rats. We stop at night. We pray. We the rats. I'm the giant rat. That makes I love the rules at the pump station. Uh, has stopped. Analysis. South turbine water flow failed. The south turbine has been deactivated. Steady water flow has stopped. Pump testing passed. The pump is operational but not receiving full water flow from the south turbine. Oh, chance is the error. Oh, change. Can't do shit there. Access for status. Uh, failed. South turbine is deactivated. Oh, change. The pump has been clogged. Clogged to not be resolved until water flow has been restored and the pump is shut down completely, then restarted. Alright, so I wanted to clear the clogging. And then we can just restart it. That's blood. Okay, okay. More blood flies. Super water. Hmm. A corpse mangled beyond recognition. Found turbine controls. Turbine is turned to power down. Activate the turbine. Safety lock has been engaged. Please input. Authorization key to proceed. Okay, we're gonna do that later. I wanna check the entire area first. You know, make sure we, ain't, we don't get attacked on the way. Alright, nothing there. I am now interested in what this is. Hmm. Oh, the scrubs have been eviscerated. Its limbs have been torn clean off and its rib cage is oddly deformed. The tattered shreds of a blue maintenance uniform hang loosely off its chest. Search the body. You find well-worn manual in. You find a well-worn manual entitled "Wanted by the Judo Da." I'll stop it. Twenty forty-two. 
the butcher saw the depictions of turbine and pumps, cross sections, tools, and descriptions of maintenance procedures. Excellent. Uh, a few pages have been bookmarked with uh, bits of paper. Go to the yellow one. Mm -hmm. This page is dominated by a, num by a detailed illustration of a turbine cross section. Oh. Stroud in the, in the margin is a number 822-896. Alright, the green one. There are some notes written margin in the space, but you don't recognize the language. The only word you make out is computer, written several times. Hmm. Alright, we got the code and maintenance. Alright, change over there. Hmm. Maybe this is where the Claudian is. We'll have to wait and see. How do we look, how do we see inside this room? Yeah, no, let's see. Holy shit, it's is it ghouls? Feral ghoul! My goodness gracious! Look at him! Dead. Not big supplies. Fifty fifty. Oh, look at that. Two damage, no AP damage. Ah, shit. Ah, clits. Clits in the law. What's this? Who's the shot? Nah, I need to have the bastard. What are the chances? Eh, so close. Oh my god, there's many of them. Trick, single shot. Fucking dead. Alright, aim shot at the door. Everyone, get into cover. You reload. Oh, you had. Oh, she had um, Overwatch. Yep, that was. Uh, that would have been good to know. Oh, well. No way someone is gonna try to jump us now. Right. 12 damage. Alright. All yours. 32 crit. 22 crit. Reload. Overwatch. Boost AP for next turn, and you run away. Boom. Another shot. Alright, that uh, boost. That was Blitz. Shit. 14 damage. 8 and... Boom! Dead. Well, there we go. Got some feral rules up in this place. The thing with the care of them. Oh, oh, what's this gonna be? What's this gonna be? It is at your scene, Trace. My income damage by free. To my stash to be sold on the black market later. Cause we gotta keep the economy flowing, you know. All right, some some spending cash. Always like some spending cash. All right, let's operation. Uh, let's see, system initializing. All right, so this controls the water pipes. Okay, so let's see. Hmm. Alright, so the only pump, well, the only turbine we know about is this one. So, let's do this. Uh, what's the code? Uh, 822. 
eight nine six. All right, activate the turbine. Where was the life? Oh my god, it's another duel. Look at them run. Look at them go. There's two of them. No. There's three of them. They just keep multiplying. Whatever will I do? And that's when I pulled out my machine gun. For some reason, the effect was over here, but. Who am I to judge? Oh, you wider. Alright, so we just walk up, grab a shotgun, to AP gone. More AP gone, disappeared. Like it never existed. And now we just hope we do not shoot our friends in the back here. He's coming in! You know, what, 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 what if I... Ten damage. Two AP, ten damage. Mm. Four damage. All right, this puts me closer for this move. Hell yeah. All right. All right. Jump from that reload and break the job. All right, one dead, one coming in. Whoa. I thought there was a wall here. Holy shit. Holy shit, we don't do it on us. Well, the closer they are, the more of my barrel they can eat. <sighs> Look at that. Look at that. Boom. I, I truly hope that would have been. That would have been it. Apparently it wasn't. All right, so the turbine has been fixed. So let's just go and restart the pumps. That should solve the problem, right? All right, restart pump one, fully operational. Lot is that clear and obstruction done. Pump research is more so that's why I'm there. That's such that's such, yeah. Oh no! A shambling mound of ragged flesh stumbles towards you. There is a lot of desperation in size. Please don't shoot! The door's breath rates of rotten meat. We are not like the others. I don't believe you. No, please listen to me. The door takes another faltering step towards you. Another step. It'll be your last. The outrageous strain makes a heavier toll on some of us than others. Many of my kin have been treated mad by the virus, but I am still the same. You've made another step out to be your last. The door frees and it's a trance. The voice begins to waver. Please, uh, may I speak? I promise you I will come no closer. I won't stop speaking. Just don't come any closer. Thank you, sir. I will be brief. We have lived down here under the clouds of Bessar for years. For all that time, this place is refuge from the world above. We traded our labor for sustenance, both for ourselves and for our feral brothers, and we survived. But now our food supply has been interrupted, and the feral ones have gone mad with hunger. They're a danger to everyone, even us. Oh, Monica, who was feeding you? The doctor, a top sider from the Trisbosa, he kept us for the contracts, guaranteed it. 
Under the terms of our deal, we maintained pumps that kept the Trasbizarre sewage flowing. In return, the doctor gave us medical ways to eat. With cooperation, we found that we could buy on what he gave us. The doctor monitored both sides to ensure mutual cooperation. But with her death, the doctor has vanished on the deal. You shut up, a bitch! But uh, for the guarantee by the contract, the Pharaoh ones have done mad, and the madness they have made it too dangerous for us to maintain the pumps. Was this doctor named Monica by any chance? Yes, that was her name. You were a reason why the silver system took care of itself. And true, yes, and true, if it would still work our pumps even without the doctor's payments. We love our occupation, it helps us feel human. But the char. The changes brought by the tree, your strain requires us to eat human flesh. If we don't, we wither and die. When our radio are feeding, well, we'll have no choice but to hunt for food. I think I have a solution to the problem. A chew, I'm not chew. Yes, please, how do you do? Well, there's only one guy in the class, but sir. There's one doctor. I'm gonna have a boy with him. Yeah, just perhaps you can convince him. Him where we could not. We have a tram link provided to us by the doctor. It is a direct line to Esbekir's office. If you call him, he will answer. Oh, really? We got people going back on deals. Damn, Monica was in charge of the whole fucking close bazaar now. I picked up the comment receiver, it's a custom job, covered together from a jumble of high-end parts. It reminds you of your mission computer. Monica's handiwork. The receiver start cut the clicks as the connection is made, after this, your voice pause in UTA, it's a thick with a blend of irritation and insults. If you're done with the button, then you might as well hang up now, I've been bled by your people for too long. There are plenty of chop shops and old and ladies out there who would pay good money for... And I am Mr. Shea, Dr. Ezekiel. Perhaps you've heard of me. Toshe. Toshe tries to hide the surprise in his way. He doesn't do a very good... But a pleasant surprise. I was wondering what I did fortune I have to meet you. If don't mind me asking, uh, what are you doing on this line? That's a very interesting conversation with some long-term long customers. I don't know what those things I've told you, Toshe, but they are not Customs, you're not paying me a thing for my service, and they've been keeping the club's uh, service running, Doc. Well, yes, but I don't know why it's my responsibility to pay for pay them for. You signed a contract. I expect you to honor it. Contracts don't last forever, and you're forgive me for saying, but to say, but I can see no good reason to continue honoring this one. You're one man. A replaceable man. My client is a business, not a charity. I'm not giving you no friends any more biomaterial unless they pay me for it. Alright, boys. So, we don't know how Monica did this. I have like 2k on me. How much is a. Uh... How much self sacrifice do I have to make? To keep this place in one piece. Well, let's 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 see the price. Uh, that will be acceptable. It won't be cheap, mind you. I'm an, I'm open to the offer. In the light of my desire to foster a good working relationship with you, and the dual spy service to the class as well as I can continue feeding them for let's say mm, a thousand yen. Better front here and now via the Tomlik input port. What's this shadow runner coming in? Can't believe it. Shadow Shadow Runner finally coming in handy. Holy shit. I have a lot of street dogs in my time. Never heard much of, never heard of much of demand for what you're selling. If you want me to sell out, you better quote at a lower price. Alright, six hundred. Deal. Fucking easy. 
we on, we from 2k to 1400 let's go hell yeah slide the grand check into a port and base the comic a few moments later you hear the distinctive thunk of machinery clumping down on a, on a plastic there's a low hum and the machine spits your credits back out oh uh, everything seems to be on order yeah it's really nice that's a shame you can tell our friend that they are feeding more zoom within the next day or two it's a they better be if i hear anything about more interruptions in their feeding, you'll have me to answer to. On that count, you have nothing to worry about today. Well, that problem's been resolved. Now I don't have to worry about the sewers. You can expect your address cage to start up again any day now. Thank you so much, Topsider. This means so much more to us than you can know. Alright, we fixed the sewers. We have people who are in charge of this, but... You know how it is. The rules will keep us safe. Cause your own cause a maintenance worker, he ain't gonna eat the rats. He ain't gonna care about the rats. He's gonna be like, ah oh, shit, there's a rat. Better avoid it, you know, I don't wanna catch a disease. But a rule he'll be like, hmm, yes, I'm gonna just fucking chill it. Cause I live here. The fresh air of the test besides a welcome relief after your time in the sewers. A cool breeze drifts across the street, carrying with it the smells of food being prepared, cheap alcohol being poured, and fires being lit against the cold. The stench of the sewers, however, still lingers in your nose about all olfactory aftertaste. At least the pumps are working again, sewage overflowing in the streets would be certainly smell far worse. Yeah, we take the good with the bad. The bad with the good. Now let's get paid. Your maintenance worker. Hey, Rich, I, found, I, I was gonna, I was worried you wouldn't be back. Tell me what happened. Everything okay? It's taken care of. You can leave uh, after giving me my money. What about Victor? Your friend is it? Come, I'm sorry. Christ, poor Rich. I don't know what I'm gonna tell his phone. So close knit family, they want. I found this on his body. Maybe we can give it to them. Hey, thanks, though. He turns the manual in the center, his thumb over the chair, warm paper cover. I appreciate it. Here's the money I promised. 500. So, yeah, it was a loss of 100. We actually made it out with 50 Nian more than we entered. Simply because, you know. Oh, well, wait. Not, not 50. Where is it? Where is it? A hundred Nian richer. What can you say? I'm simply a good Samaritan. <laughs> Alright, let's see. What do I need? Boom. Dead eye. And there it is. Throwing weapons. Now I can shut shit all I want. Oh, was this people leveled up from these two missions hell yeah oh what's this she's gonna be bringing grenades yeah give me more damage mm. oh let's see let's see she gains biotech dodge rifle and shotgun all of those are useful a biotech, not as much, but yeah. She's a sniper, she wants to see things. What's this? Pfft. Wired reflexes. I, this is pretty popular on the tabletop, not so much here. Uh, Fred or let's see. But it, it costs two AP for her to throw shit, so. Let's see, plus four, that's like a 16, May, maybe a 20. Uh, grab the flashbang. Alright, Daytrich, let's see what you get. Earth element or fire? I like my earth elementals. Ooh, here's a boom or gold. Or a platinum. Ooh, 
Ooh, both of these are excellent. Strength, intelligence, ranged combat, biotech and dodge. She's get, she gets a lot more than most people. But then again, yeah, I think her ranged combat is low. Let's see. Uh, a reusable health kit is much more useful. Alright, your first upgrade, but he gets plus one quickness. True, yeah, man. Wow, he gets a total of actual jack shit. Or oh, this is a 1% damage increase 100% of the time. Where in the fuck are we? How the fuck did we go there? Hmm, alright gentlemen, we're gonna, we're gonna make a big rest, we're gonna see what we can do with a dancer. Tip the dancer, yeah. Whew. I thought it was gonna be something like steal from her, damn. Good thing, good thing I ain't a bad guy. Yeah. Anyhow. I was just telling me you were around. I was wondering if you might be willing to trade a story or two. Hmm. What are you looking for exactly? The girl taps a finger against her chin. Hmm. Well, you're new here. <clears throat> I know you know about Monica. I know I know you knew Monica. And I had a vague idea what went down the night she died. But I want to know what you think. Your most exciting adventure has ever been. Hang on. How the hell did you hear about that? Remember, I'm all through tears and hands outside of the cafe. We share a lot of intel, he and I. Alright, so... <laughs> so what's the story between you two? She glanced away briefly before turning her gaze back to you. I suppose I can tell you. If the monitor thing was a secret of yours, it's only fair I share on, on my own. I never really went to school. Pretty much been a street kid as long as I can remember. There's been so much to learn from people outside of school that I never really bothered going into the school. <laughs> Makes it difficult to get a job, so as good street kids do, I chose a place to hunt with my friends and always hang out there. Hell yeah, a uh, street corners. And I was out there at the cafe, and he was super nice about me and mine. I felt more comfortable with him than I ever did uh, with mine, but her eyes narrow only for the briefest moment in the wood. And we talked a lot when I was waiting around for my friends. He must have been very comfortable with me too, otherwise he wouldn't have offered me a job. Well, that's nice of him. Sure was, but see, you I ought to be going. You know where I am? If you got it for me, yeah. Alright. Mm, I should speak with him, but no, let's, let's continue the story. Yeah? Yeah. Alright, let's see what I... Oh, shit, yeah. Alright, so, let's talk to Blitz. Good guy. Hey, Chief, you need some? Just stretching your dinner, right? Great, Chief, no, just great. It's real nice to be able you know, to wind down and relax for a change. No more worrying about this janitor or that janitor sneaking behind me and slipping a knife between the ribs. Let's do a change, Chief, that's it. That here, happy to have you here. Go, sure. He just said himself with a flourish. What's that to be happy about? Any thoughts about the sewer run? Nah, not the one without Bama Chief. Catch you later, bits. I don't think. Good boy. Alright, that's right. Yep. You're really through for me, boss. You ever need anything from me? Anything at all? You can call on me. I'll come run. <laughs> so how's that I've been hoping, holding up? He's a good kid. That afternoon, mind you, some time and he'll shake chat to his programming. It might take a while, but he'll adjust the life here in the clothes for so. In the meantime, I'll find some good home for him. Samuel's a great take care of him. Samuel's a great take man. Is that why Samuel's employees have no love for humanness? Most of them don't look like humans. Ah, best thing for the kid to learn from immersion. If he stays with the Samuels group, you have no choice but to interact with metahumans. Soon enough, you'll learn that they're no different from anyone else. 
first day's be left though, no question. But I'll make it through. Come out the other side, a better man for it. It seems what tough kid, I don't doubt you now. I don't doubt I don't doubt you on that. You're a good man, Bush. On the end on to the other things. Remember what I was telling you back before we climbed the van? Yeah, you were saying that the Dragon Slayer was happy. That uh, you've been given a reward. That's right, thanks to our let's let's not mince words here. Heroic actions back in the swamp pit. The Dragon Slayer has seen fit to grab me his favor. And now I know what that means and what you do with it. Well, don't you mean suspense? He gestures at the ground near his feet. This. As you are, the spot the dietary is pointing out begins to glow. Lines of force spread out in a silly, scintillating web. And the feeling of raw pulse suffuses your body. I've just torn open a channel between myself and the Dragon Slayer. The power you feel is his power. Pouring through the eater into that spot. If you're familiar with ley lines, it's the same basic concept. I concentrate on a patch of ground, and as long as I stand in that spot, all of my magic, boom, gets powered up. The better. Hmm, now look at this. Already going with practical applications. What about another major shaman? Would they get benefits? You sure? Yeah, don't see why not. Like I said, it's basically a ley line. As long as you're on the great Dragon Slayer's dude set, I don't see why you couldn't use it. My idol, he ain't stingy about gifts. And I also want you fiddling with this. <laughs> Learn to properly control it. I'm sure you got things to do as well. If they care whatever needs doing, then by now our next one, I'll be ready to use this. Alright, take care, my man. I like this guy. Most likable sword. Alright, uh, let's see, do I want to talk to anyone? And now I want to grab a grenade. Don't mind me, just grabbing my usual grenade. As you approach, I return to face your rifle has been filled stripped in his line in peace on a sheet of butcher paper. Arranged in neat row along the edge of paper are bottles of copper solvent, bore clean, cleaner and lighter fluid. Our fearless reader returns. What do you need? Any thoughts about the last one? Nothing I haven't talked about. Alright. What about you? Lauren? Lauren's expression remains distant, but her lips curl upward with a hint of a smile. Need something? Ooh, let's go. Any thoughts about the last one? You didn't bring me. Alright. No sweat. Hell yeah, no sweat. I'm stealing that line. No sweat, boom. No sweat, homie. No sweat. Christ. Ah, oh, my fucking ears. Ah, oh, shit. Alright, let's see. Uh, any responses to this shit I am interested to? Uh, no, just... Uh, these two characters speaking in that touch you. Thank you. Need to <laughs> we need to think of a 50k. Well, mission computer. Shadowlands BBS. Search for relevant keywords. Trances Highlander, best new deck? Holy shit. Did you get one of these from Tans Neuronet rep? Wants me to sell them in my store, so I took the pop for a test drive. Signal quality is insane. Which are a huge difference in comfort, deck, and fatigue. I can stay jacked for hours and feel fine. Last session I set a timer just so I wouldn't forget to eat. Lumens. The specs in that thing look impressive, but I'm an allegiance man. Does the comfort really make that much difference? My decks are generally beaters anyway. Allegiance, what are you doing with that? They playing video games? Any sort of serious decking is going to require much more horsepower than a thing can push, even overclocked. Only a crappy deck to blame is the G. I do just fine, thanks. How much is the trans to spain you to post the steam skis on me? <laughs> help drown in junk. Alright, champions, I could use your help. Every time I check uh, into the matrix, these days I'm flowing with junk mail. There's so much I can't even see. Can anyone help me? Rowan Thunder. Right, and I know he thinks he's on the text board. 
Hey, stuff it, I won't ask, but I'm desperate. I can't think like this. A smiling bandit strikes again. <laughs> All right, then, the calm down, son of the I'd bought his teeth to your death. Keep poking around that. Anyways, been poking around anyway, sketchy like me. I don't need details, but yes, no, we'll do. No, but I haven't been anywhere like that. I swear, please help me. What you want to bet? He gave his personal info to some scam set. I give you 10 to 1 odds. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Oh, that was a make an online dating profile. Let me guess. Meet and mate. How did you guess? That's not a real dating set, and it's a place that's where people go to get infected in my way. But what do I do? How do I make it stop? I don't know, but I know that. Best of luck. Ah, another one. Ooh, post the human safe house list. Post will remain active for two days. <laughs> what can I say? I like a little money. Alright. Ooh. Money! Yeah, let's go. Alright, check my inbox. Uh, let's see, we need to talk to Shay from Dr. Xavier. Don't make me a kid listeners, there's a matter we need to discuss. To Alexander, to Shay, hey Shay, I'm... The doctor told me that I could message you here, so I figured that I should. He probably told you that I'm living uh, at Samuels, right? Huh? Yeah, that's where I am, it's different, but I'll give it that much. I like that I don't get pressured uh, to hurt people <laughs> That's good. And nobody's smashing around, even though I can tell that's a lot of tr- I mean, uh, the orcs and trolls want to do. I do get yelled at a lot and told a lot of names, but I guess that makes me feel bad about the kind of thing. He's all part of the plan. A bit of bitch. That kind of sucks right now. Well, at least nobody's going to make me kill anyone. That's what he says, that it's going to get better. Maybe it will. I don't know. Anyway, what I most want to say was, uh, thanks for not killing me back at the humanist compound. I had a gun on you, so you totally could, uh, but you didn't, and I'm, uh, I'm totally glad that I'm not dead. <laughs> this train flickers to life and Maxim Swiss appears. He's wearing a broad grin, and you can hear the sound celebration in the background. Hey, damn muscle. That chef that gave me the right address, but I figured it was worth a shot. I don't know if you heard, but my favorite poly club right here with all this from all sons, but the F state then. It's glorious. And I was thinking that you want to share the good news. And thanks to help out there, I don't think we would have made it out there without you. Thanks to shit. The message ends, the image fades, and you find yourself back chain box. Alright, so well, let's let's start with Doc. He seems like the type of person we really should have been talking to. Alright, let's see, a dock. I know exactly where a dock would be. The body shop, yeah? Yeah. Oh, uh, next street over. There we go. Triad Sabbath Clinic. Damn, look at this place. So fucking nice. Look, bro, look, look at that. Look at that chair. Wish I could get one of those for my grandpa. Yeah, well, if it isn't Dr. Xavier, it's a Oh, let's go! Mm. Dr. Man, what can I do for you, my friend? Yo, I found this game out. Think you can hook me up? Mmm, yes, very nice. Design appears to be simple enough. Yeah, I should be able to provide you with this. It won't be cheap, though. Let's see what you got on Cyber. Oh, we got the classic Kevlar license. Plastic. Kevlar plus, look at that. Plus one body, plus one strength. And lower essence cost. Mm, mm, oh yes. Good old bone laces. Let's see. 8 HP, quickness, HP. Ooh, we got some bio inf influences, other some cards from granting the user a subtle edge. Charisma bonus. Damn. Our reflex with, ref with a reflex with Ooh, adds one movement. When triggered, you will dodge the first attack against you each round. For three rounds. Damn, that's good. It's like, it's a sandy. <laughs> Auto injector. When triggered, the accuracy increased by six. Any coming damage increased by three, three rounds. Probably. Mm, no. Sorry. I tricked my body like a temple. 
at this battle. Boost hearth on sheet one dodge and throwing weapons movement. Holy shit! It's so useful. That useful decorous and we just don't want to sacrifice valuable headwear space. What? Induction data gen? Holy shit, it's it's like that that game with those uh robot twins. <laughs> All of this increases their own speed for short bursts, loud move, spring rapid, plus free movements. Damn. I got a success. It's brought I can just laser designator. So, so much, so much. I got your message. Would you want to discuss? Business. I have business. I have a job for you. Ah, I'm always interested to hear about these. Good. Let's get down to brass that, shall we? Night before I, emig I emigrated from uh, here, from my native of Spain. I worked in partnership with the Berlin-based R&D company. Uh, the biotech they were developing was very hush hush, really, really cutting edge. Our arrangement was that I could bankroll their research, and that they in turn would provide me with unique merchandise to sell in my clinic. My clinics. Go on. About two years ago, things went sour. My name was Slater, the flicker mistress that is public perception turned against me. <laughs> An ugly business, I assure you. Even talking about my fall from grace my stomach turned. And the injustice, all of it. Is almost too much to bear. What did I choose you of? He says, What didn't they? Theft, medical malpractice, the sale of stolen goods, other and more cruel for accusation that they, they do not bear repeat. The barat was then and this is now. I come here to Berlin to escape all of that. Of course, I also moved here to get closer to the lab that I funded. And the merchandise that I owed. That I am owed. So I mean, yes, you want me to go fetch merchandise? Yes, and to find out what happened to the lab itself. The facility is locked down, you see. Nearly impenetrable. No idea why. As I was packing to move to Berlin, all was well. Sixteen hours later, I arrived to discover the building locked tight with my merchandise inside. The Turk, a druid, has been running surveillance in sight since I shut up saw up here. In that time, no one has entered and no one has left. Ooh, whatever went wrong in there, you must have to the research team. I want to f I want you to go in and find out what happened. Recover the cyber that they were developing. And get out. The building has been abandoned. I'm surprised that uh, the lot that's sitting on has been doubled by some corporate. Why didn't you approach? Ooh, why didn't you approach Monica about this? Who says I didn't? I had a let us say a tumultuous friendship with your dear departed Monica. We had our uh, ups and downs. You see it on this pro subject. Uh, she was more certainly down. That was her choice, and I'm hoping you will be savvy enough to make not make the same mistake. Mm. All right. It's been abandoned, so why hasn't uh, Corp got me? Don't be. Back when I was a wealthy man, back before my legal troubles, I paid the lease for a decade in advance. Holy shit. And before you said yes, it was a huge expense. But that's well, what's locked away inside of that lab is worth ten times what I spent on it. I don't want anyone playing, playing a claim but me. All right. Let's, let's stock money. I can offer you 2,000 yen, plus first track to whatever buyer that you retire from said. I will, of course, have to charge you anything that you want to have installed, but I can provide it to you with a discount. Ooh. This is top of the line where we're talking about, mind you. But then anything else that I didn't start, and because it's biotech, the essence loss from him, planting it will be minimal. Ooh. It's a good deal. Win win for you, really. Alright, my man. That's the facility you're looking for is the former laboratory of Sutterlin Bioscience. That the Yubaha to the Adenat Platz. And you should find it. Best of luck. Mm. Yep, looks like we got our next job. Only 2k, but we do get a nice little pain. We get a nice payment, so I'm happy. Uh, we get a bonus of. Bioware, but uh, it is what it is. A similar team. We're going to go recover some gear. 
All right, I am guessing we're gonna need a medic, and we're gonna need a doctor and shaman. Look at this, Forster. Air. What does this man bring? Run Rocker Craft Work One. Let's go. Look at all these. Mm, interesting. Beautiful. Now I'm going to sit. Shut Kevin's in. Wow, people making up all their shit. Let's go. Hey, hey, don't panic, don't panic. <clears throat> Lockdown. The ride to the other place is at this moment. Your only company in the train is another way dwarf in a rugged peacock. And he spends most of his time muttering to himself. Then the train matters to, rattles to a stop and he slowly reaches from his perch and begins to hobble towards the doorway. The station itself isn't much different. An old approaching Dante at the end of its useful life. He will totally into one's obsolescence. The city of Berlin has clearly been seen better days. Now when the light shines down the surface, you had better look And even that looks stale. Slowly you begin to climb. Don't even know what I'm speaking with a fucking semblance of a fucking Irish accent. Just that is just, just, just decided upon it now. Ah well, streets about the dice but the dark in this one. This year has been seen better days, everything here reached the Vietnam depression and faded glory. Glory. <laughs> Lower above you is a fortress large seemingly impregnable force facility. The windows have been shattered with enormous steel panels and landed the entire building a sinister appearance. That's a target set to the embarrassments. I wonder what's in there. I wonder what happened in there. It might still be happening for all we know. That's a cheer for Dr. March. If let's get this over with. Alright, Blitz. Alright, look at all this trash. No one will be picking it up. And on this side of the street. Hmm, any homeless people I need to worry about? And I don't see cameras in those lampposts, but. That don't mean shit. The sole area reaches of a battleground. Who in the fuck are you for? Yo. Can't talk to them. But you know what they're doing? Yeah. They're probably here to... Tell us... Aha! You got the Bioware. Now we're gonna steal it. The power of trash is tr steaming. Faded veins and stench wash over you as a drawn ear. But damn, that's trash. I'll stay back here. If you don't mind, I have a better thing to do than it for a pile of decomposing trash. It might not be decomposing. The steam could be coming from a grate or vent under the pipe. Well, I ain't touching it. Let's move this. Let's move the trash. Hey, look, we got a we got a vent. Do we have a drone? No. A dwarf might be able. Ooh. A dwarf for drone. All right. Let's inspect the door. Damn. This door is sealed tight, dirt, dust, and grime to the corners. It's like no one has been through here in any, many months. You can see the hydraulic jacks locked in the door in place near the bottom of the frame. Alright, I'm going to just try to brute force the hydraulics into the compression mode. You strain against the smooth metal, wrenching the hydraulics with all your might. After what seems like an eternity, you hear the tortured sound of tearing metal. In one of the jacks comes free from its housing. The resulting balance draws the door to shoot upwards, jamming it to the top of the door with a metallic crunch. Routing beyond repair, the door is easy enough to push you away through. The path into the lab is clear. What can I say? I'm simply the powerful. Alright, now for the harder part. 
Oh yeah, cameras. They do not appear to be turned on. There's a window, so observation terminal. So what were they observing? This terminal governs the animal testing wing of the Suterling Biosites. Data entries concerning animal test subjects and the procedures performed upon them. So the menu screen. Subliminal Biosites. I'm not testing observation terminology. Hellhound testing. Basilisk testing. Ooh. Hellhound. This entry contains notes of various invasive test procedures that were performed on a channel of Hellhound test subjects. There are several memos appended to the file. Apparently, scientists working in the animal testing wing were less convinced that working with dangerous, fire breathing animals would yield useful results than the executives were. <laughs> so it passes. The entry covers the most various forms of experimentation and testing performed on Sutherland's prized possession. A rare arm. Albino basilisk required from an exotic and modula in Portugal. It appears that a basilisk was being used as the primary focus of a passion project in Sutherland, an attempt to create a magically active piece of bioware. Why the executives in charge of the project felt that a basilisk would make an appropriate test subject is not clarified. The list of procedures performed on the creature is extensive, including a series of unauth unauthorized torrid surges. Hmm. Alright, so animal testing. So we might be fighting animals in here. Mm -hmm. Alright, that yeah, shouldn't be too hard. Come on, I beat a cathedral invasion in Cold Vein. Not a lot of things are harder than that. Ooh, terminal. Uh, the terminal appears to contain an inventory control system for the Sutherland Biosense merchandise. The item they're spelled out in amber lettering against a solid black background. A glowing cursor awaits your input. So then my a product in specimen inventory. Tissue bands, organ farm, breakdowns and analysis, replication and fabrication, contract fulfillment, animal testing when special projects. And Breakdown and analysis. The center contains a complete log of studies performed by certain employees on the products of competing biotech companies. Bioware samples by Universal Omnitech, Shavers, Protest AG, and Biogen have all gone under the knife here, and the results of each day session have been meticulously recorded. Okay, Origin Farm. This entry provides a complete breakdown of the standard origins that were grown in the organic chemistry wing of the Sutherland Biosense. It seems the lab was fitted with the capacity to mass produce fat grown meta human organs, including hearts, kidneys, livers, and lungs. This material would be used for testing purposes, replication, and fabrication. Ooh, this entry contains more notes on Saturn's attempts to replicate products that it had previously dissected and studied. According to the information here, Saturn had achieved a shocking level of success at producing genetic versions of a wide variety of commercial and restricted biover products. Good for them. These knockoffs parents were commissioned by an outside investor and have been moved into cold storage into a set of impending transport. Excellent. This entertains a complete breakdown of the ordinance waiting in cold storage to be claimed by clients and investors. Standing over the list, you see a number of high end of high end security level enhancements in the inventory. By a rare like this would normally run tens of thousands of Nien. If this was what Ezekiel was commissioning Sarah to produce, he would to undercut all of his competitors and still make an ungodly profit. And now special projects. This entry details a uh, number of projects that involve testing on awakened animals. There are lists a number of hellhounds, including their complete medical histories. It appears most of the experimental procedures here have, were performed on a subject named Billy, but who or what Billy might be was left undisclosed. Well, we've got an idea of what to do now. Clearance B panel. Hmm. That's a key card panel. Alright, can go there. I'm gonna say that's a key card, so let's see what we can do here. Well. Then there is like behind end, mate. 
Maglock with a swipe key access system. The status screen indicates the lock has been overridden by local computer network. Now, Jim, what about this one? The orange smart received months of disuse have left the tower in a thick coat of dust. The simple swipe key access system has been mounted into the door frame, locked letters, and the system says read accepted clearance only. Okay, and this door. At level B. Okay. Well, time to test what this thing is. It's a ladder going into the sewer system. Well, if I know me video games, this is gonna be like a key card or something. And there's gonna be an enemy here. Nope, it's 57 bucks. Oh. Oh, what's this? Okay, okay, underground facility. Be like clearance B panel. Hmm. All right, we have a lot to explore once we get a key card. I mean, we could we could just brute force it. Oh no, we could have just walked around like we did. Uh, let me guess, Hellhound. And it turns out that the primary weapon system for pacification. One down. Oh, oh, that's a, uh, that's a tank. Shit. Let's see. Here's one arm. Let's do this. And let's see. Nine damage. Strips to armor. Alright, minus 2 AP. Nothing major, no damage. Boom, smart link, dope. Alright, there's one of you. Oh, what's this? Pierces up to 4 armor. Well, I don't mind if I do. Look at that, mm, a pin that you to move, Ah, He's about to experience final death. Eight damage. Eh, I kill it. Boom, I get healed. All right, that was, that was interesting. Nothing here, door override terminal. All right, I'm gonna just press a few buttons. Uh, let's see, this is your computer drummers unlocked and the door leading to the main lab. If you want to, you can unlock the door from here. It is now unlocked. Alright, there's something in here. I want it. What are you? You're a couple of dots. Anything in here? No, it was a trap. It was, it was nothing. Who the fuck are you? A wild eyed young man is standing in a lab coat and fronts you. His beard is bushy and unkempt, but bare patches of skin show through. Yeah, you there. He starts to warn you, his hands twitching. How dare you enter my domain? I'll be the one asking questions here. I hurt you, Will. You've trespassed my, on my sovereign territory and murdered my peasantry. You've invaded my home. That murder is we're dead alive, one here, Bosh. He continues his rant without pausing for breath. You're a murderer, a monster will pay. Oh, the, who the fuck are you? I am Philip Lex, the Knight King of Sutherland Bioscience. I will have you banished for your transgressions, Orc Man, banished to the Underworld, and left to the ravages of all powerful Billy. He paused, blinking. Hold still while I fetch the robots that will banish you. Oh, 
Oh, it's, it's, it's a cool line. <clears throat> All right, so he's gone insane from being here for too long. Uh, Billy is in the basement. Probably a mutation. An, amalgam an amalgamation of random mutations. And this guy is uh, one of the is if not the only one of the few survivors. I destroyed them in self-defense. No, they wouldn't do that. They were gentle and kind. You're an outsider. You understand a bond of trust and respect that we shared. I did my best to make life good for the peasantry. I struck their plastic cases on a daily basis and I threw pleasing melodies to ease their troubled minds. But the old days are over now. My peasants are dead. You destroyed something beautiful. Ah, shit. Yeah, you know, two years. <laughs> Alright, uh, sire. I'm sorry about your peasants, but I'm on an important uh, quest. The grateful is an instant when I should hit the razor place with Lord. Ooh, well, that changed everything. Various quests and civilian casualties go together like chocolate and peanut butter. I can't stay mad at you for that. Tell me about the stress of yours. You're a good orc man. Leave nothing to the imagination. You have my erect intention. I need to get my hands on a buyer for a pro tips that will be stored in the executive wing. His eyes go, the executive wing? Madness. Take this as a warning, noble stranger. If you intend to forge your way into the land of milk and honey, you do not sit at your own peril. You don't show at your own peril. The underworld stands between you and your goal. And the underworld is home to the murderous Billy. Uh, I think I've read about this Billy. He was a certainly so being a bastard, right? Was it right? Was it right? No, he is much more of a creature legend. Huge experimentation are me the beast into the ultimate killing machine. He's smarter than ten men and five times as deadly. But then, your soldiers have to chill. <laughs> A fool's errand. I never tried to kill Billy once. He thought by eating the beast he could steal its power. Hubris. Billy devoured my friend for his insolence in the last remaining chart. You have Chi Chardi was lost. Oh. He the, he was a beautiful fool, that Heine. I told him that we didn't need to eat Billy. But we could survive indefinitely on sentence the charity its tissue and choco nubs. But he wouldn't listen. And the e and Chi Chardi was lost. And without her that you no longer access the it's such the win. And it's expensive snatch bar. <gasps> I have eaten nothing but fat grown meta human organs for a year and a half, stranger. I would kill for a chill boy. Chill to a nub. Alright, just tell me how to get to the fucking one. Very well, stranger. If you cannot be dissuaded, I will help you. The ragged lab that fishes in his toad party with a bony hand and produces a thin slip of plastic. He presents it to you with a flourish. This is my most prized possession. The incomparable Chi Card B. He was in the suit in the center of the underworld and faced Billy. If you should survive this encounter, search for the lawn missing key tardy. Use it to reopen the executive wing. And I will see that you are nicely, you are richly avoided. What the, uh, this man has been... Holy shit. Holy shit. No, I can't believe it. I mean, he survived. Holy shit, that's, that's, that's congratulations. Alright, looks like the media is set up is wired into the building security system. The video feeds from all cameras of the facility can be viewed here. Alright, let's see what we're dealing with here. Page in through the computer's file system. You'll find a number of archive video feeds from the building surveillance system. In addition, episodes 1 through 6 of an old Slovakian period fantasy called The Night Kings of Light. And hood. Hold have been saved to the machine's desktop. I remember that show, it was terrible. I mean, really, really bad. Made uh, Neo the Orc Barbarian look like high art. Me and my buddies in the 
I swear it's a hand, see? You just get high and laugh at it. It only, it only ran for seven episodes before it got pulled. According to the computer fire system, each of the six episodes have been viewed over 400 times in the past two years. The last marathon viewing was this morning. Alright, let's see. This is probably us. Uh, this was Billy like a year and a half ago. This is the loss of the E key chart. The E key chart. <gasps> As the video of feed gets in, Philip is near in an ambient discussion with someone who's standing just outside camera range. You can see his shoes and his shadow, but nothing more. The voice sounds human. You guess that the camera's off. The off camera speaker is a man in his uh, early 20s. Look, we've survived this long. If we play our cards right and do a proper bit of rationing, I reckon we can live off the executive snack bar for a long time to come. Of plenty of fine shirt and those won't be a problem. We got mixed nuts for protein and we can get our vitamins and minerals from the diet powers. There aren't many of those, but like I said about no ration. I'll be willing to bet that we can hold out for two, maybe three months on what's uh, stashed away in the snack bar. We're sure to be rested before we run dry. You're fooling yourself, my other darling, an unpleasant truth rather than facing it. We have to accept the fact that we could be stuck in here for a long haul. The snacks are great and all, but they can't be our state for food stuff. We have to stretch them out as far as humanly like possible. But that means supplementing them with something more substantial. There's a long pause. You don't mean. Look, let's think of it like farming, right? If we look after our crops, we'll always have food to eat. We have enough supplies on hand to keep the tissue torturers in Ord Shemvinger growing indefinitely. What I'm talking about is growing meat for our own survival. That's all it is. Meta human meat, Phil. Synthetic hearts and livers and kidneys grown to be implanted to people like you and me. You're talking about eating people with hearts. It's fucking disgusting. I won't do it. Unless you fancy dying of malnutrition, you're gonna have to. You know that as well as I do. Organ meats are rich in vitamins and minerals. Chlor Chlorine. Chotan, vitamin D, bioavailable iron. All things that we're gonna need if we want to survive in the, in the long term. You won't find much vitamin D in licorice sticks and chocolate nubs. I thought you know, they were never going to rescue us. We're in Berlin, Heine. What's the day? Who do you think is coming? We have to be prepared to survive here for a long time. Maybe years. All that means is making the most out of resources at our disposal. We're talking about resulting to cannibalism, man. No, I'm talking about eating meat. <laughs> An image flickers onto the frame. Philip leaning against the wall, listlessly chewing on an undefiable chunk of cooked meat. He looks miserable. A drone comes to inspect him, and he pushes it away. Heiner's voice crackles, and over the intercom, Philip doesn't look up. I'm going now, Phil. No more arguments, okay? There is a long pause, and Leon responds, and Philip takes another bite of meat and gnashes it with his teeth. I'll kill that fucking thing, you see? The goddamn basilisk is going down! Once we can get down into the sewers, we might be able to find a way out. This is a change, Phil. He's dead. Damn, the video feed flickers out to the stream. In it, you find Philip standing in the corner of a room and you're in and out. Though sad with exhaust and he carries a haunted look in his eyes. Heiner. Is notably absent. Cheap synthesized music pipes in from somewhere off stream. Philip turns to stare in the direction that the music came from. A smooth baritone voice sings out a phrase in Slovak. A half second later, a different voice shouts the translation in German. Night comes of lightning old. Oh man, that's a, that, that's the show. I forgot how bad the dub job was. Phil upstairs, glassy eyed as the show begins. The synthesized music blares. A troll actor. A deep trollish voice rumbles out of media center speakers. Ah, to draw new shrecks would offend my realm. I do so swear it before my magic sword. Argonar, this I swear. Elf actress, an alarming, breathy elvish voice sings out in her But it was. The Zutras horns will smite you if you stay. The people in that valley are all the peasants. You didn't throw your life away for them. Flee with me into the engine that was Shalashim. 
<laughs> Please make it stop. My life is so on to protect those present. She elf. She elf. She witch. And back the enchanted trees, if you will, but a night chain will never flee. But this is a voice comes in. Out in a veil. Feel lilt in veil. You cannot die. I love you. Then go to your father and beseech him to rise elf troops southwards. For if the Thelonious Earth falls, Lightning Hold will fall. And Lightning Hold will not fall. The troll drones on, audibly struggling to emote and occasionally tripping over these lines. Overall, the acting is quality is rough on par with what you would expect from a primary school Christmas pageant. Here upstairs at the stream, listens to chewing his mate, his nose is wrinkled in distaste, and his fist clenched and unclenched. Mercifully, the video cuts to static. Eight months ago. Oh god. Oh god. The strain flickers in a video feed of Philip Pops on the screen. He's standing in the corner watching an episode of Night King of Lightning Hold. His jaw hands slack and he stares at the stream in rapt attention. But father, the tennis starts switching his life. Nay, he's very soul to defend Lightning Hold from Jupotinus. His enchanted Ardenar feeds upon his honor and bravery and seeks to transform him from a noble knight king into an evil demon lord. Philip's lips move silent and mouthing the words as they are spoken evidently he has committed the entire strip to memory. <laughs> my darling daughter, that is why I cannot send my troops. Your beloved Atenas has watched the knife's edge between light and darkness every time he draws the devil blade from its cabinet. It is long time that you learned the truth about me, Betada. I was the one who trapped the demon lord Jatalabot between the blade. <gasps> but father, you can't mean. The big dear to her sharp jazz. The mom's the motion a tear begins to trace its way down his cheek. The music just makes it so beautiful. Yes, my daughter. I was the one they called Thunder Spear, the sworn enemy of the Tenure Sorts people. The Hunger Barbarian tribe. Then all this is your fault, just on us. I said to my beloved soul, all of it. It was the only way to solve Chalashin, my dear daughter. Chalashin and your mother, who I hid away when you were but a girl. She is still alive, Brianna Day. As Jerry John throws by to inspect the pool, idly he rages out and begins to stroke its case and petting it in, as if it was a house cat. Alright, today's video. Ah! The stream flickers and Philip appears on stream. He appears to be dancing with one of the security drones. The little machine beeves and bobs frantically to avoid colliding with him. And with every motion, the lab that slides in to fill the empty space. Around and around they go, twirling and gliding across the laboratory floor. There is an enormous smile on Philip's lips, then let's go dim and an alarm begins to sound. Danger, danger, intruder detected. Security protocols engaged. I admire your bravery, noble vessel. Rayworth stands on top of the little drone. But this is my fight. I, Philip Rex, will defend this land my life indeed. But my very soul. Sir, please clear the area. Hostiles. <laughs> no, no, boss. It is you who must. I repeat, clear the area. Hostiles inbound. He's not slowly. His face beaming with pride. Maybe you're right. I am more than night king. Perhaps this is your time to shine. I will not rob you of this moment of glory. I will allow you your moment in the sun, for when you re return victorious, I will grant you lands and titles to reward your heroism. Please clear the area. <laughs> well, we will never speak of this again. <laughs> ah, that was beautiful. Beautiful, I say. Ah, we really needed that. Alright, let's go to area B. Let's face Billy. Swipe my Clarence B cheater. The key panel's LED indicator blips to a more pleasant hue. The door unlocks with a pop. Oh. Um, hey, look, the first agent. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, it's a, it's a 20. So let me just replace. Yeah, I'll replace that. Cool. Alright. Lock safe. 
Alright, let me swap the clearance PT card. Great job. Schematics auto inject the blitz. Yo, anyone. Uh... Anyone see a basilisk down here? So, um. Maybe it didn't spawn? Did I miss a trigger? Am I in the wrong ear? Oh, it's over there. Fuck. <laughs> Never mind. I, I, I chose the wrong door. Ah, it happens all the time, you know. A, a key card here, a key card there, the exact same key card. It could really mean anything. Ah, here we go. Alright. It turns from red to green. Let's see, two hellhounds and a uh, billy. Alright, so, dash uh, You wanna boost up? Hell yeah! Our glory! Teach this hellhound a lesson. 50 HP! 90 HP! Damn, Billy! What the fuck have they been feeding you? Well, let's see. Uh, that thing's mostly harmless. Man, my full auto is so good it jumps from a different direction. Alright, here comes Billy. Poison Spit, Stream, I don't know. Petrifying Gaze. Oh yeah, it's a Basilisk. Fuck. How could I forget what a Basilisk was? What a perfect throw. Oh, let's go, let's go. Charge in there, prepare for battle. Oh man, what's the worst that can happen? It's stunned. Where the fuck did you come from? Well, time to beat the shit out of it. You know, just, just uh, 90 HP. A casual watch in the park. Target marked. Set damage. Um, AP damage. And um, armor pierce. Or maybe. Earth Elemental, yes. Alright, what can you do? Powerful, the pierces, the guards. Uh, punch it. Haha! -ha. Oh no, I am being attacked by a dog. Let me deal with this. What can I say, I'm, a, I'm something of a master. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Oh, you son of a bitch. Alright, uh, you die in that. You son of a bitch, alright. This is for betraying me. You fucking son of a bitch. Alright, just shoot it. Misses most of those. Why? Well, just. You gotta miss most of them. Yeah. 
Oh no, I am on fire. Come on. Ah, oh, shit. I mean, she only lost like half her MP. Ah, every round they just full auto, full auto, full auto. That's right, you son of a bitch. You perish for betraying me. Alright, let's grab this piece of sable here. This E card E. Anything to pick up here? Alright, no. So we were attacked from behind. Where the fuck did it come from? That's the big question. Well, Billy is dead. Do we talk to the crazy man? I will talk to the crazy guy after. Let me pick up what we came here for. Yeah. Yeah. Swipe the key card. Alright. The gates, they finally opened. He teleported. The snack bar. Thank you, my friend. You have granted me the secret desire my heart has yearned for most. A respectable supply of non-organic based foods. You will always be welcome in the hallowed halls. I feel the proud so do swear it. I want to know more about the underworld. The nether realm that lies beneath the hallowed halls of subtle and biosense, and it's manish labyrinth of dripping pipes and filthy brickwork. But it rules supreme down there. To set foot into the underworld means certain death. Strange that someone would build a labyrinth under a biotech company. It is, isn't it? It's a mystery. A conundrum. It gives me connections. What would they have intended it for? The torture of the innocent? Perhaps the builders had the prescience to foresee the coming of Billy. Or maybe they intended it for basic sanitation. It's a sewer too, by the way. But it is also a nightmarish labyrinth of... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Alright, you're eating the night chains of light and hold show, aren't you? It is my life, my entire life, my reason for being. Well, must be rough being that bit of a fan of not having seen the ending. He realizes that he's been struck. You're saying there's more? Yeah, the last episode before that cancelled, you know? The haste of written final chapter where you find out what happened to the Jubiton invasion. I didn't always start the day with left the end into the imagination, like a beautiful dream! He fidgets and Trump. But now the dream is over. I will never know peace until I have seen this conclusion for myself. He lurks for his cl hands clasping his opportunity. You must help me. You must find a way to show me the final episode. I need it! I'm able to bet that I could do that, Chief. His damn not know, might not know how to disengage the quarantine, but I bet that I can. And once we've established the building matrix of Smash, it will not be a deal for me to download the last episode from the watch. Not now, so we keep much, but for a while. Yeah, I'll see one out. Go ahead. Should I think, Chief? Uh, the terminals on this building are all network connected, so I should be able to drop the quarantine from uh, any computer in the place. Oh, thank you. This is the happiest day of my life. Uh, Alright, let's do it. You know, we could just drop the quarantine from any of this. Any computer in this place? You fucking kidding me? Have puts this needs the protocol. Alright, Chief, watch more work. The blitz puts in his plan to determine and puts the escape key with a flourish. A second later, he hits the Y key. <laughs> the building's lights flicker. The chain have. You have something else, right? Drag you to the matrix. The chain have been it. You, you still have to do something else, right? Drag you to the matrix or something. Nope, that's it. Quartz in the snitch. And now to get Philip the last steps of a bullshit trench show. His fingers dance over the dance keep. A few minutes later, he glances up with a smile. Done and done. The horrible conclusion to that terrible show is waiting for Phil in his media center. You want to know how it ends? Not particular. Too bad, because I'm telling you anyway that they did sex in his elf suite. His dad make up a bunch of elves fight the Jupiters and get their asses kicked in the whole Jabber of the Demon or subplot is dropped because the show's effort budget to get. In the end, the Tano saves Light and Hold by railing a peasant revolt. It comes out of nowhere and barely makes sense, and the whole thing ends in a vomit inducing love scene. It's goddamn Trevor. It sounds magnificent. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's, uh, let's still fill it 
you can go watch a show. I want to know about Protein Bioware. Uh, about our first time stuff. Pain is this. Edit to us. Trauma happeners. Orthodons. Things like that. And all of it was reverse engineered from resistant Bioware products. Huh? I read up on uh, Sutton's process. Uh, that's right. Knockwaffs. They just work to lead to most places. Not here in Berlin. Our investor needs it. They did it that way. Gotcha. And that's when we just need to hire a company in Spain. Yeah, at the risk. Here in Berlin, no problem with the law, because there is no law. You just have to be careful. Oh, for not, though. My drop is Bordeaux, just like the real thing, but who cares? All of it. Just meet in the end. Not to me. I need this stuff and I'm living without... Yeah, get me into the statue to win. I can... And we can both get what we want. Feel your apologies, take whatever you want. I on hand and roll away myself in snack bar. What does lockdown? A calamitous series of events. It begins with a spill top of soy chaff and ended with terror and blood. <laughs> Someone spilled soy chaff, that's it. Well, no, naturally. The inevitable result was an, such an incident followed the spill. They wanted. Yes, that, that wasn't an explanation. Then you shall have one. Where to begin with the Sotia? One the morning of the lockdown. All was well. Creasibly an executive was making his rounds, walking down the tons from Tronzo to Tronzo to check upon us. He had a bubbling cuff of Sotia in his stubby little hands. We all know that food and the drink were forbidden outside the employee lounge. But Grazier was a proud man and he would not obey the rules. His pride was our undoing. He tripped and fell. Then his soy chaff spilled into a console in the animal testing room. There was a terrible snap of shortened circuits, coupled with the stench of ozone. All over the building, the merchant lights flashed and blared. The building went to quarantine mode. He raised his voice and gestured chaotically. The doors locked and shutters slammed closed. We were all trapped at latch inside, but we were not afraid. They were sure that the malfunction would be fixed within the hour. We did not know what was coming for us. Unbeknownst to any of us, Trace Bertier's devil beverage had done more than an initial false torrent, and it had also shorted the locks on Billy's cage. The albino basilisk slipped its paws, and in that moment the reign of its terror began. <sighs> Within a half hour of the spell, Billy was slaughtering everyone who could have disengaged the lockdown, and such teams were torn from them from when their business attire was shredded. Their expenditure reports paid in blood, and the rest of us were trapped inside the savage, within the savage beast. He falls out blinking as he watched his expression clouds, when he switched against his voice is small. In the end, only Heiner and I remained. We may have to trap Billy in the underworld, but there was no hope to stay for us. It's been two years, so I must have come knocking before now. No, as far as the outside world was concerned, we were simply still under quarantine protocols. Nobody knew why. Nobody cared. The building had presumably been sealed for a reason, and the world at large wasn't in her to crack it open. Heiner and I found ourselves completely isolated from the outside world, with a terrible creature running loose in the basement. Our choice were able to give up and die, or make the best of it. The man at that you've come to expect floods back into the lab tech. He spreads his arms wide and no things smile and other can play in the sleep, which was ladder. We persevered and eventually transformed this trust of a building into the glorious kingdom that you find yourself standing in today. It was all for the best in the end. I tamed this land. And I have grown to love it. I will never live anywhere else. Uh, the recording is off now. The final episode of your show is on the record's computer. The Yash, the place would be known and brought to the land. Well, he's off. Well, oh, time to get what we came here for. Uh, let's see. Anything in. Oh, shit. Look at this. Well, time to get what we needed. Please don't be ruined. Please don't be ruined. Please don't be ruined. Well, experimental biomare samples. Hell yeah. We got everything we came for. Easy job, all in all. Well, what can you expect from the best as you emerge? Hey, look, it's it's a shadow. It's, it's, it's idiots, we're not sure. 
As you emerge from the light of day, you find yourself standing face to face with a very of all security personnel. A man in an expensive suit raises a megaphone to shout at you. You stay where you are! The matter for real isn't necessary, man. I'm standing ready. You have a place of stone by a fair samples that you're tearing on the ground. They lie on your belly with your hands on your head. Do it now, or I will order my man to open fire. I didn't steal shit. The owner of this material commissioned me to retrieve it for him. Is that you, you mean? Well, we all know about him. He has quite a reputation back in Spain. Uh, where would she was her streets from? And our material infringes on 15 of our company's patents. The orders that you're carrying are based on our intellectual property. This is unbelievable. This place locked down for two years. You chose today to come visit? You think this is a nature incident? We came when the core team was broken. We have died in this place since the lockdown went into effect. Let's see when you open the doors. Why the way you have broken into this place months ago? The building was torn, and the you see for set up a camera that it is the amount of hazmat cleanup effort. As long as the counterfeit merchandise was contained, we didn't care where it was. But it will not hit the streets. Now shut your mouth and hit the floor. We all hold my man to open fire. Don't make me kill you, man. <laughs> Your shirt said in the stress. Idiot Shadowrunner, Pe you people don't know when to keep your worship. Man, open fire. He's dead. <gasps> a shrill voice crackles over the building's intercom system. It reverberates through the empty switch. You will not threaten this man, Jupiter. The fuck? Do long have my people lived in fear of your aggression. I, Philip Rex, will protect this land from your mongrel deprivations. Corporate sportsman turns to address the security officers, but uh, you two a enter the building and find where the fucks on the intercom and kill him. Yes, sir. It turns the <laughs> back to face you, reaching for the sidearm at his hip. Bad idea. As for you, the lab set voice rings from the speakers. Underneath it, you can hear the distinctive sound of fingers hammering on a keyboard. Hmm. Wait, there's there's like five of them. There's, there's six of them. Holy shit! Peasants, arise and defend your home. You need only believe in yourselves. The power is yours. Mimo, mimo, beep, beep. Is he? You can be fucking serious. Oh, this is priceless. We're under attack. The LARPers are at it again. <laughs> Everyone get to cover. The LARPers are at it again. Well, you know what this means, right? Oh no, I've been wounded. Well, into cover I go. Boo sucks. Anyone out in the open? You! Ah, shit. Well, it is what it is, as we say in the business. Uh, you got this, Glory? Hell yeah. Alright, uh, go, go fucking kill this man. As for myself, well, don't mind me, I'm going into full cover. Peasants defend us! He's going after the tank drone. Magic! <laughs> What the fuck are you doing? Summoning? Oh, you have to go. You have to go, you know that, right? 
It's walking forward. <laughs> it's so beautiful. Hmm, fifty fifty. Seventy two, let's go. Get fucked. What can I say? The peasants are rebelling. Oh, uh, he's dead. So let's get on this mage. Uh, let's see. I threw a grenade. Dead. Uh, what's uh, he? He bleeds for ten. <gasps> Fool! Left yourself wide open. I love this. No! I I am. They're having fun with this. I didn't love it. <gasps> Boom! Get grenaded. The peasants are rebelling. Are we gonna make this no loss? <laughs> Fucking annihilated. Two for one special, baby. Oh, what's that? You wanna live? Too bad. You made a wrong choice in coming to this place. We will not suffer. As a small begins to clear, try jubler sounds over the centering by a sense builders into Trump system. We did it! We've done it, my friends! The Jubilant Hordes have been defeated! This great victory, I declare a new age of exploration and commerce. Our peasants will form trade agreements with our neighboring kingdoms, for the betterment of all. You get that your neighboring kingdoms are just office buildings, right? Aha! Yes, of course! It is the same way that the Saturn Empire is just an office building, eh? <laughs> Empire said one is. Don't question him, just roll with it. We need to get this pirate back to his YouTube before it starts to throw. Fair, uh, Star War Torchman. We will remember you always. You hear the rest of the sound of Phil pushing himself away from the intro. A few seconds later, the buildings in the car were speakers fall silent. So, what's with these guys up here? They were literally just set that dressing. Like not they did not they didn't do nothing. They were just randoms. Holy shit. Well yeah, let's let's go back. So we clean the sewers. And uh We saved the kingdom. The bio trap trip back the uh, I did not do that's is a shaky one surprise another train is packed with the only of the seats at the, at the very back of the car a hard looking young mo mother watches down the aisle dragging her free screaming children behind her two boys and a girl each around six years old as the woman nears you her eyes fix on the frozen pouches of bioengineered meat that you're liberated from sometimes it's like to freeze her She opens her mouth to say something, but at that moment, uh, the little girl jams her finger into her brother's nose. The boy howls and the young mother's shoulders slump slowly, robotically. She turns back towards her destination and begins to try go forward, dragging a squalling offspring to forward with the solemnity of a funeral procession. Eventually, the train comes to a stop. Uh, you admire grave for legend of freezer's worth of bioware samples behind you. It is what it is. <laughs> Two karma gained. Alright, uh, well, it's, it's, it's given the Bioware. Nothing good can come from us keeping the Bioware. No one expects the Spanish Inquisition, apart from me, who fully expects the Spanish Inquisition to come knocking any second now. Yo. Hi, right, do you have a word this? Yeah. Ah, you do? Yes, exactly what I've been waiting for. Hmm, good work to see. 
The doctor turns away, referring through the samples and inspecting their labels. He looks at a kid in a candy store. I will transfer 2,000 into your bag for jump, and I will give you a moment. If you give me a moment, I buy the samples that you brought out to my inventory. He looks over the samples that you brought him, and already begins punching their serial numbers into his PDA. I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. And I fear, excuse me. Thanks, Doctor. Well, oh yeah, let's, let's uh, jump the... Uh, yeah, found the schematic. Can you install it? Ah, these types of weapons have been popular with some of the local games. Yes, I did install it. I don't need payment for the materials. Well, what payment? I give you money? Fuck you, Dubai. I'm out of here. Wee. <laughs> I have no idea why I find that funny. Look at that. Five. A whole five. Karma. What can we spend it on? It's like... Uh, it's like... Nothing! <laughs> nothing. Absolute chat shit. Please tell me I can at least save an entity. Ah well, well, we'll just hand it over the next time. Two hours, eh? Under two hours. Do that enough. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, thank you all for watching. Now I can save you. Alright, uh, thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hope I can see you next time. And, much more always, until next time. How I do the one, ladies and gentlemen. See you.